when Calvin's here, he's preaching, and sometimes he's preaching twice on Sundays and every other day of the week, every other week. So he's preaching a lot, and, and it's affecting his health. And so is the one that preaches on the odd weeks. So when the weeks that, that Calvin's not preaching, Monday through Saturday, it's Beza that's preaching. And when Calvin's health gets worse, it's Beza that keeps taking his, his position. And finally, after Calvin dies, then it, Beza takes his position. Beza comes here not to be a preacher. Beza comes here to be a professor of Greek at the academy. And so he's the first president of the academy. So obviously, remember, this monument is really a monument to the University of Geneva. And so Biza is, is very obviously, they're going to put him up there because he's very significant to the University of, of Geneva. If you think of the other followers like Bollinger in, in Zurich and Melanchthon in, in Wittenberg, when you think of them, both of them kind of diverted from the theology, right? Melanchthon ends up writing the variant, which changes the view of the Lord's Supper from consubstantiation to more of the, the spiritual presence view of Calvin. And Bollinger changes things that Zwingli believes. Bees is the only one that actually sticks really closely to what, what his predecessor held. And, and part of that is because his predecessor was a lot more sound doctrinally than Luther was or Zwingli was. And so he ends up being here until 1605. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe and share it with your friends. You can also visit www.discerninghistory.com for more videos and other resources.